Hello! And welcome to my little home office here. Today we are going to make a little video on um, connecting Reaper, which is a digital audio workstation on one computer, to Titan, which is running on a separate computer. So I want to bring timecode from Reaper to Titan. It is rather easy if you have the correct versions. I use Reaper version 5.984, which is a little older version. Um, and what you also need is a little program called RTP MIDI. You get this, uh, it's available for download. If you look for RTP MIDI, written by Tobias Ericsson. Here we go. You can download it there. There's a little tutorial and this is all, almost all you need. I close this again. I have already installed it on the Titan machine here. Have a closer look and start RTP MIDI. This is how it's configured. So SBHP is the name of this computer. It has already made its own MIDI port. This is a virtual MIDI port. And all we need to do now is to make the same thing on the Reaper machine. So let's go over to the Reaper machine here. Yeah. At the moment in Reaper, if you go to Options and Preferences, there's only one uh, MIDI output in the output de in MIDI device section. And the MIDI output is Microsoft GSF Table Send, which is a default instrument by Microsoft, but you cannot use it for uh, MIDI over network. So we install um, RTP MIDI. Double click on RTP MIDI setup. I have downloaded it just some moments ago. I don't need a shortcut on the desktop. I agree to the terms and let's install it. Go. Here we go and launch it. At the moment, there is no session active, but it already finds the other um, installation, which is available in the network. So we start a new session. It defaults to the name of the computer, which is a very strange one. So we call it, how we call it, RTP Reaper. Okay. So this one as well, RTP Reaper and enable this session. Here we go. And now we select the other session in the network, SBHP, which is our Titan machine, and we click on Connect. And now it says, Ray, uh, I have another participant in the session. If I go over to the Titan machine, it shows the same thing there because it says, okay, uh, the uh, participant RTP Reaper is, has joined our session. So we are ready to go. Back to Reaper, please. Within Reaper, we go to Options, Preferences, and now on our MIDI devices page, it already finds RTP Reaper, which is our local virtual MIDI port. Double click, enable output. Okay. Okay. Almost there. Now we need to insert a new track, which is insert SMPTE LTC MTC timecode generator. This one needs to go on a separate track. We extend this to the length of the entire music. 
like so. Okay. Now please do not, please do not hit play now. At first bring down the volume of the second track because now the music plays again and if we bring up the volume we can hear the time code and this will this will certainly bust your eardrums, your headphones or whatever. So that's why um, be careful. What you do next is right click on the track, go to item properties, go to properties again and toggle this from LTC, which we could hear, to MTC, which is MIDI timecode. Okay. Okay, now it's safe. Now you can bring up the volume if you want to, because you can't hear MIDI. What we also need to do is go to the output routing, which is here, but this depends on from the very uh, Reaper version. I just click there, um, go to MIDI hardware output and change this to RTP Reaper. Okay, and now I think I'm already done because if we now in Reaper click on play, it should be possible. So Reaper is um, top left and button right is Titan, the Titan machine, which are networked together. So, and in Reaper, I just hit go. And in Titan, you see the time code already runs. So, again, just install Reaper, install um, RTP MIDI, and basically you are good to go. Um, I show you a little bit more if you start USB Expert Console. You see that the virtual MIDI port is detected as, um, as a connected panel there. This works only if you are running at least uh, Titan version 12 and if you have some proper Avolites hardware connected, that's why I have a T2 connected here, so it does not run with the editor key or with a Titan 1 or T1. So at least you need a T2 or a Titan Mobile or something like this, because um, this, what I showed you here, is something like USB MIDI. And if you now click on the virtual MIDI port, SBHP, again, this is the name of the session, and go to the uh, timecode tab, you see the timecode run through. Yeah, that's it for today. So, rather easy. And um, what else to mention? Okay, everything you find here will be, either is already or will be available in the um, wiki at avolites.de slash wiki then you can go to um, external control there is already a little example sec uh, section there for uh, things like controlling Reaper from Titan on the same PC and I will add this one there soon. So have fun and start time coding right now. Go ahead. <laughs>